I'm Joe Gatto. I'm Steve Byrne. We are two cool moms. We certainly are. And guess where we could find us now? Oh, I don't know. The iHeart Podcast Network? That's right. We're an official iHeart Podcast, and I'm super excited about it. <laughs> I am too. I thought Two Cool Moms was such a fun podcast, but now it's even more funner and cooler and heartier. That's right. It's more iHeartier. I knew it! <laughs> Check your heart rate. We're here at iHeart. Yeah, you can find us wherever you listen to your podcast or on the iHeart Radio app. History is filled with unexpected stories, and I'd like to tell you about them. I'm Aaron Mankey, and for the past six years, I've been sharing history's most curious tales on my podcast, Cabinet of Curiosities, such as the surprising country that invented the croissant and the wrestling champ who won the White House. And now these amazing stories and many more have been compiled into my new book. Curious to know more? Pre-order Cabinet of Curiosities, available November 12th wherever books and audiobooks are sold. Learn more over at grimandmild.com slash curiosities. New Girl fans, get excited because Jessica Day herself, Zoe Deschanel, is returning to the Mess Around Pod to discuss the season two finale, Elaine's Big Day. First of all, like Taylor Swift, like, if anyone ever says anything mean about her, I'm so mad because she is such <laughs> a nice person. Mm-hmm. She is so cool. Listen to The Mess Around with Hannah and Lamorne plus Zoe Deschanel on the iHeartRadio app, Apple Podcasts, or wherever you get your podcasts. Muhammad Ali, George Foreman, 1974. George Foreman was champion of the world. Ali was smart and he was handsome. The story behind the Rumble in the Jungle is like a Hollywood movie. But that is only half the story. There's also James Brown, Bill Withers, B.B. King, Miriam Makiba. All the biggest black artists on the planet. Together in Africa. It was a big deal. Listen to Rumble, Ali, Foreman, and the Soul of 74. Starting October 9th on the iHeartRadio app, Apple Podcasts, or wherever you get your podcasts. Hello, from Wonder Media Network, I'm Jenny Kaplan, and this is Womanica. October is the perfect time to delve into all things spooky. So this month, we're talking about the women who give us goosebumps. Some are real-life creators of spine-chilling works of fiction. Others are the subjects of frightening folklore. Either way, these scream queens are sure to give you a scare. It's the dead of night, and you've stepped outside of your house for some fresh air. In the distance, on the edge of the woods, you see someone. You squint through the dark. It's a beautiful woman with seductive eyes. She beckons you with a light flick of her wrist. Come here, she says. You are unable to look away, captivated by her gaze and voice, drawn into the depths of the forest. But as you wade further under the canopy of the trees, you realize you've made a horrible mistake. The woman has transformed into something terrifying. She stands on just one leg, blood dripping from her face and hands. She smiles, and her mouth is full of sharp, feline teeth. You've fallen into her trap. Let's talk about La Patasola. There are several different versions of La Patasola's origin story, but legend goes that she was once a beautiful human woman who lived on a ranch in Colombia with her husband and their children. But over time, her husband began to suspect that she was cheating on him with the ranch's owner. To test his suspicions, the husband told his wife that he would be going to the village for the night and therefore would not return until the next day. But instead of leaving, he had a few drinks at the local tavern and came back to his home, just in time to catch his wife sneaking out. To where? He wasn't sure. When his wife returned home, the husband asked her where she'd been. She responded that she had just been washing some clothes. He didn't believe her. Why would she be washing clothes in the middle of the night? A few days later, the husband concocted another fake journey into the village. When he snuck back to the house, he caught her kissing the owner of the ranch. The husband was driven into a fit of rage. He grabbed a machete and lunged at the ranch owner, killing him with a single blow. Next, he set sights on his wife. He swung the machete at her, lobbing one of her legs off entirely. Not long after the attack, she died too. That was not the end of the woman's story. It's said that she came back as a vengeful, one-legged spirit called La Patasola, which aptly translates to the single-footed woman. 
Lapetta Sola was a supernatural huntress, hell-bent on punishing any men who crossed her path. She particularly liked to prey on lone men. Sometimes she would sing. Other times she would scream for help, tricking these men into coming into the forest to save her. When the men ran to find her, she trapped them, sucking their blood. Afterwards, she retreated into the woods, waiting for her next victim. La Pata Sola is part of Colombia's rich folkloric tradition. The many iterations of her story contain elements of the region's indigenous culture, and also have European influences. She's become an important female presence in the spiritual landscape of the region, and her story is known by many. Despite her violent tendencies, La Pata Sola also offers a lesson in humility. She's a protector of the natural world and keeps men from defiling the environment for profit. The indigenous people in Colombia experienced brutal violence at the hands of European settlers. La Pata Sola's story reminds modern residents to live in harmony with nature, rather than exploiting it. For others, La Pata Sola has become a symbol of resistance against domestic abuse and violence. Many people in the region are empowered by La Pata Sola, a powerful woman who stands up to aggressive men. Just don't get too close, or you might be her next meal. All month we're talking about Scream Queens. For more information, find us on Facebook and Instagram at Womanica Podcast. Special thanks to Liz Kaplan, my favorite sister and co-creator. Talk to you tomorrow. Am I doing the right thing with my finances? Am I saving enough? Can I buy a house? Am I paying too much in taxes? Will I be able to retire? Putting a financial plan together feels impossible. What if I told you there was another way? Take FACET's free financial wellness quiz to get your score and a snapshot of your current financial health. Visit FACET.com now and discover your financial wellness score today. That's F-A-C-E-T dot com. This ad is sponsored by FACET. FACET Wealth Incorporated is an SEC registered investment advisor. This is not an offer to buy or sell securities, nor is it investment, legal, or tax advice. History is filled with unexpected stories, and I'd like to tell you about them. I'm Aaron Mankey, and for the past six years, I've been sharing history's most curious tales on my podcast, Cabinet of Curiosities, such as the surprising country that invented the croissant and the wrestling champ who won the White House. And now these amazing stories and many more have been compiled into my new book. Curious to know more? Pre-order Cabinet of Curiosities, available November 12th wherever books and audiobooks are sold. Learn more over at grimandmild.com slash curiosities. I'm Joe Gatto. I'm Steve Byrne. We are two cool moms. We certainly are. And guess where we could find us now? Oh, I don't know. The iHeart Podcast Network? That's right. We're an official iHeart Podcast, and I'm super excited about it. <laughs> I am too. I thought Two Cool Moms was such a fun podcast, but now it's even more funner and cooler and heartier. That's right. It's more iHeartier. <laughs> I knew it! <laughs> Check your heart rate. We're here at iHeart. Yeah, you can find us wherever you listen to your podcast or on the iHeart Radio app. New Girl fans get excited because Jessica Day herself, Zoe Deschanel, is returning to the Mess Around Pod to discuss the season two finale, Elaine's Big Day. First of all, like Taylor Swift, like if anyone ever says anything mean about her, I'm so mad because she is such <laughs> a nice person. Mm-hmm. She is so cool. Listen to the Mess Around with Hannah and Lamorne plus Zoe Deschanel on the iHeartRadio app, Apple Podcasts, or wherever you get your podcasts.